The United Nations Security Council, on March 8, 2024, called on Sudan's warring parties to immediately cease hostilities during the Muslim holy month of Ramadan and allow it to reach 25 million people in desperate need for food and other supplies. The start of Ramadan is due to be on or around Monday, in accordance with the sighting of the crescent moon. The 15-member council voted overwhelmingly to adopt the British drafted resolution with 14 countries supporting and only Russia abstaining. Sudan descended into chaos in April when long-simmering tensions between General Abdel Fattah Bouhan's military and Mohamed Hamdan Dagalo's paramilitary rapid support forces erupted into street fighting in the capital, Khartoum. The fighting spread to other parts of the country, particularly urban areas, but in Sudan's western region of Dafu, it took a different form, with brutal attacks by the Arab-dominated rapid support forces on ethnic African civilian population. The United Nations Security General Antonio Guterres, on Thursday, urged both sides to support a Ramadan ceasefire, warning that the nearly year-long conflict threatens the country's unity and could trigger regional instability of dramatic proportions. The African Union also backed a cessation of fighting during Ramadan. Bohan welcomed the United Nations chief appeal, but the Sudanese foreign ministry issued a statement on Friday listing a number of conditions for a ceasefire to be effective. The resolution expresses grave concern at the spread of violence and at the catastrophic and deteriorating humanitarian situation, including the crisis level.